Another emergent. Are you kidding? Because it must have gained a population. I'm gonna have like a billion of these little larva guys. Get my babies all together here in Sun Temple. Should we send a bunch of larva to deal with the problem? Probably not. Welcome back everybody to episode 18 of this Let's Play series of Age of Wonders Planetfall. We're playing as the Celestian Kirko in the My Galactic Empire mode. And we are conquering the planet of Melkor. My name is Gracian. Welcome to the channel and thank you for continuing this series with me. And uh, let's get started. So my hero is is my faction leader is once again dead. So I keep losing keep losing him. Oh, that's a lot of food. That's awesome. Slow moving through here until we get a road system. Operations primed and ready. Production ready. Sun Temple produced the better breeding grounds. That one here as well. Why do we get this emergent? What? Where'd you come from? Wait, wait a minute. Does this, does this building do that? This colony produces an emergent whenever it has a happiness event or grows a population. Oh, okay. Well, so I got this little guy to do something with. Um, I guess you go over to Sun Temple and await orders. Very in faction demand, I guess. I don't have a choice. Orders required. So let's make an army out of these. I think this guy will be the commander. So let's move these two to here. And we'll give them these three. Um, so that's ranged and melee. We've got two melee, two ranged. We even have some support abilities in here. So do we need, we need one more unit to give them? This unit sucks. Um, 2004 power though in this stack. That's pretty cool. Could give them the B unit and then actually mod it. We want to mod this B unit. It has a range attack. I mean, it could already destroy his armor. Regenerative carapace. Sprouting infestation. It's so fun. Yeah, let's give it regeneration. Whatever. We'll just have everybody regenerating like crazy. Melee attacks cause poison. Enemies adjacent take poison. Biochemical attacks can apply slow. All right, we'll just put that on there. So the growth. I don't have a B symbol. What the heck is the bravado bundle? Oh, I remember this. Guess I've never used them. Let's check the biochemical. Oh, I wish there was a B. I bet you there's a B somewhere. Amazon, don't have a B. Generic? We'll do this symbol because it looks like a sword of poison. I don't know. We'll call this the unbelievable. Wait, is that how you spell unbelievable? So now we want to go join the war. So we got to go. Do we have open borders with Ellen? We probably don't. We, sh well, we can't go through the water, so I have to go around, right? Unless I get open borders, but we'll negotiate that with her next turn. Therians would like me to do some historical research. Dearly beloved, we sung the story of our great leader, Deer, for generations. We owe everything to her. But through, but through time, the details of her life have grown vague. You have access to old archives and knowledge, right? Will you help us tell her story? Sure. Okay, can I go? Oh, I can't go through her territory. Okay, Ellen, please. Oh, I can't, because my commander's dead, I can't negotiate. So I'll just have to sit at the borders for a second. You have a semi-real army. Is there anything you can clear out around here? I guess you could go down this way. Fight some of these random stacks. Just 
It's a Cosmite node here. Stronger than our army, though. A little bit surprising. Can I... No, you'll level from this, though. So maybe we hit them with a Operations with a bomb. Ready. We'll requeue that soul fire here. There we go. Let's do that one manually. This is going to be a little bit weird with the in, in, uh, instability, the geothermal instability. It's got a really nice position up here for launching electricity barrages. Yeah. So we don't want to get too much closer than, say, here for now. I don't think they're going to get any closer. I don't think I need to go into Overwatch. Nice little clump here, so we'll probably go ahead and drop one of these corrosive detonators. Cause that'll that'll knock two armor out of the ones that hit. Yeah, that's pretty nice. So now we have to approach. This is unfortunate. We're gonna take could take a lot of ex damage from these uh, cosmite tears exploding around us. I don't really have much other choice though. This is a little bit of a nightmare to get around to this little position they have up here. Just out of range. Man, it's like they did that on purpose. Oh, there goes the burning. Everybody's on fire now. No, don't get a crit. Nope. Oh, God. At least they feel bad about it. Broken mind. Gotta take out this barrage back here. This is one of the biggest problems. Are you blinded? You're blinded. Dang it. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. What's happening? It's blinded, but it still has 95% chance to hit? How? What? doesn't show blinded in its list of problems but it says it's blinded is it immune to blinded from something I don't I don't get it negative morale effects hmm it must just have lots of bonuses because this one is affected by I guess I guess so that's very interesting The hell is this? What is this? Hollow reel obstacle. What? Where did this come from? Chance to hit is halved when attacked through cover. Why is this here? 
Almost stand in it, I guess. That's very strange. Can't use Overwatch because we're blinded. Could do a quick cleansing light on me here. To Gracian. I what's happening? Snipers are great. No line of sight to this one for some reason, so we'll take this shot. Enemy down. Slap him. They're pretty messed up, aren't they? Blinded, broken mind, dimensional instability, electrified, and reverb. <laughs> Uh, poor guys, and yet they're extremely happy. I want to hit my own unit, though. Unit in the way, 30% from long range. We come closer, a little higher chance to hit. Enemy annihilated. Oh my god, 34 damage. Yeah, that'll do it. That was a pretty fun battle. Okay, we got 16 Cosmite. We'll take that. We'll kind of scooch over this way. Now, we won't regenerate because of this instability, unfortunately. So, we couldn't get out. So, we'll have to clear that and then maybe go away for a bit. Upgrade your hero. So, we can now get advanced piloting once we get three more points so we could spend two points um we could spend two points and still have enough so armor is so good though juggernaut's pretty good let's get the dead eye five percent hit chance and critical chance is really never wasted and then we'll have enough points for the advanced vehicle we can put them in a barrage or something can we pick up a tank? Oh yeah, we can't get in that. That might be the, the weapon for us. We'll take a look. Another is this another emergent? Yeah, it is. Happiness event in colony. So we could farm emergence by having tons of food. Or I mean happiness. It's kinda strange. So every less than every four turns we spawn more little emergence. Okay. Ready. A lot of bees, worker bees and soldier bees. Interstellar trade convoy. They say it's bad luck to pass up a good deal and we've just been offered one. A convoy of interstellar traders has hailed us, uh, saying they, they will trade some of their energy and knowledge for any goods or repairs we're able to offer. Ener energy and knowledge generation is 50% of production instead of 25% for 10 turns. That's very cool. So that's definitely something we're going to want to be doing with our cities that don't have anything to work on. Okay. These two can work on science, though, for sure. 
Who's back? Oh, faction leader's back. Good. So you're gonna go back to Sun Temple. Another emergent. Are you kidding? Because oh, it must have gained a population. I'm gonna have like a billion of these little larva guys. Look how squishy and small they are. What am I supposed to do with these now? Incoming communication. Uh, okay, fine. You guys need a compliment of some kind. Here, you've improved your relationship with the growth. That makes you good. Happiness event in colony. Annex another sector here in by Dexil. Uh, I don't remember what we're going to do with that. Probably grab this one. So let's send somebody up here, like one of these healthier ones, to go and clear this geothermal instability. And then the rest of these guys will head down here into this territory so they can start regenerating. It won't be disabled in this area. Oh yeah, we need Ellen Shaw to give us access. Negotiate. Can we please have an alliance? Great. Can we please have open borders? Perfect. Thank you so much. I'm going to go over and kick your enemy's butt. Got some spawning problems over here, don't you? Don't you think maybe you need to deal with that real quick? Go grab this weapon. Link shard. Annex its first sector. Oh, we skipped annexing the first one we could have. That's my bad. Uh, we do want this sector. We'll have to clear that out maybe for next turn. This one's got a influence building. So let's grab this one first, I think, because we want the roads. Control 50%, 80%. Oh, because we popped up from our alliance with Ellen. Cool. Everybody has a lot of bees. Just spending a lot of money on bees from the growth. Malai and Ellen forge a defensive pact. This is quite interesting now. So we have this, this ally up here, ally here, ally here, and then we're in the middle. Could this this could not get any easier than this, right? This is from the growth. Slay some units. We can do that. These are mad preachers. Another biochemical boys here, Magma Basher. Two Mad Preachers. Oh, these are tier four. This is nothing to joke at. Joke at? Scoff at? I, I don't know. It's one of those. Should we send a bunch of larvae to deal with the problem? Probably not. Unexploited sector. So we probably want energy. I don't know that we really need production from here. Get my babies all together here in Sun Temple. Oh, we can't go with this because we want to make sure the whole stack is there to pick up the banner underneath to level up. I could ignore this spawner and leave it for her to deal with. I do like that, Dizzy. I am busy. I mean, we've got to fight this actual player up here. Who's this? Burhain? Or Burhane? I don't know how to say that. You could use another turn to, to heal, couldn't you? Tactical supply charge. Oh, we don't heal in this sector. Shouldn't have done that. So that's a turn wasted for healing. Darn. Rotary cannon. Cool. I don't know if we're going to make this quest. We still have 16, 15 turns left after this. We need to gain two more populations, so it's it's possible, I guess. Objective completed. All right, we've researched the dearly beloved. We'll take our reward. Ravenous cast. So we have the ravenous done now. So that's a vehicle we were going to put who in this guy. Right now, does he have advanced piloting? He does. So let's go ahead and slap him in a ravenous. I guess he's inside the creature. Cause I don't. 
I guess he's inside there somewhere. It's quite strange. Sci infected claws. This is more fun. Let me switch that out. Now, Shield of Remorse. We could also give Tenants of Healing. Non mindless infantry mounted and battle suit units. Do we even want one of these tenants on here? With this particular army, I guess not. Right? So we just want something more like damagey, I guess. Sprouting infestation is pretty darn good. 30% damage. It's not getting tankier though is the thing, but I do want to leave the regeneration on. So this is gonna do a ton of damage, but not really have a ton of survivability. Um I think we'll take that. That's a lot of our cosmite, but that's awesome. I mean, look at him. Close combat specialist. Go ahead and grab that and do a little bit of extra damage. Fun. Uh, oh shit, we haven't cleared this out yet. Weapons facility. So we need to build something strong to go over there and deal with this. And I don't mean sending a billion larva. That does not make sense. Uh, we haven't built the elite military facility either. We're just never going to be done building here, are we? Probably auto this, yeah. Okay, this is exciting. So close that off. Now that should... Aha! The Remora. So now we've, we've metamorphosized into this tier 3 unit. I don't think this one changes. Now, so this one now has Devour Life, Melee Repeating, Bypass All Shield, Bypass All Armor, uh, Cripples, um, Psionic Larva. Units killed by this attack transform into Psionica Leeches. What? Okay, this heals when it strikes non-mindless units, gives a stack of glutted, so it's feeding on their, on their mind, on their brains. It's the brain bug from Starship Troopers. And a Sling Psy Crystal. A uh, big AoE psionic attack. Wow. Catatonic, broken mind. Damn. Yeah, I like this. I like this a lot. Crippling Claws. This is probably not the right mod for us here. Hmm. Easier to hit. Not really a problem this guy's going to have. Psionic attacks heal the caster for 8 health on use. Psionic buffs grant 2 shield and gives plus 10. Now that'll work with us because we're going to give glutted, which is probably a psionic buff and would give this character more shielding. So max health. Want more defensive mods here or no? We can stagger immune. Yeah, is there one that's like eating a brain? Here, we'll use this one. Uh, yeah, I think we'll just call this the uh, brain bug. Gotta heal up a little bit, but then we can think about going in here. You're level 10. Good god, that's pretty high level here let's see deny the void on death the hero loses all essence charges and returns to life with 10 health plus an additional 10 for each essence charge lost now this guy has a hundred health right now so I don't know if that's what we need well not in a vehicle first strike no infantry ground maybe we get the commanders ground heavy ground units this is a heavy unit this is a heavy unit, heavy, light, and light. So maybe we do grab ground commander. Personal weapons expert is pretty good value. And then we could even give this character watchman just because it's an option now that we're going to do pretty bad damage, but it's nice to be able to use that at least 20% extra accuracy. So let's confirm that. Yep, 
Get the military skirmisher barracks for free. Um, now we're gonna wait till we heal up a little bit. Plus, it just pooped out a unit, a stack of units. So we're gonna want to wait a second for that. Uh, set our military research. I'm gonna grab this tormented up here. Pretty powerful unit. And then we'll probably come back and grab some of these mods and stuff. Uh, and that's going to do it for this episode. We're all out of time, so I will continue this in the next episode. Thank you, everybody, so much for joining. I hope you're enjoying watching the series. If you are, please consider liking and subscribing, and I will catch you in the next episode. See you then.